Hey friends, welcome back. Happy June 2nd. Listen, if y'all don't even like this video, appreciate it. Please give me a thumbs up for the fact that it's 99 degrees outside and I'm out here in this heat to get some damn free toothpaste. Because I know there's somebody out there that needs some toothpaste and some newbies out there that need to learn how to keep on at Walgreens. So, with that being said, I have some of those... Um, register rewards remember the ones that were like glitching well they expire tomorrow on the third so I have $20 worth that I'm gonna be using and also in the Walgreens ad if you flip the page you will see sorry my phone is going off you will see where it states that you get 10 times the points oh um 10 times the points uh, when you spend $20 and you cannot pay with points but I'm gonna be paying with register rewards so I should be getting 10 times the points so with that being said let's get ready to go inside of Walgreens in this fucking monkey ball hot weather oh oh it's hot it's 99 so um, these are the register rewards that I'm using again if you don't have these don't worry about it um, these we got these like what two weeks ago a week and a half ago um, so they expire to, uh, tomorrow, so I wanna make sure that I use them. So I am not gonna be paying with points because I'm gonna be scanning um, the ad and I'll show you when I get up to the register where it says um, when you spend $20 or more, 10 times the points. So that is what I'm gonna be doing with that. And your first deal is gonna be an absolute freebie. So $1 off of Crest. So that makes these $1.99 each and when you buy two, you are going to get a $4 register reward, which is one of these. So you'll get one of these back. Now, these, um, you cannot, I mean, if you do this deal and you get a register reward, you can't use the same register reward and do the deal again. Now, if you just wanna come in and do the deal and you got these coupons and you're like, oh, I wanna pay with points. Yes, you can pay with points and get points back. I mean, and get the register rewards back. Um, but don't use the same register reward that you get to do this deal again because if you do the register reward will not print I hope that makes sense so let's just pretend pretend this is for Chris you got this pretend you did the deal you paid with points and then you got one of these printed and you're like oh I want to do this deal again well yeah you could use these to pay but you're not going to get one of these printed again if this one was for Crest. You can't use the same register reward to do the same deal and get another register reward. Hopefully that makes sense. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna grab two of these because these are included. I'm grabbing two of those and then I'm gonna get a register reward back. And sorry, that went out of focus. That's gonna make them completely free. Now I can do this deal as many times as I want throughout the week, even throughout the day, but um, that's all I'm doing for right now. So just make sure you check this, these stores on the um, tags to get the ones that are included. There's also a Colgate deal, but they don't come out to be free. Um, and you only get 2,000 points when you buy two. So this week we're getting the Crest for free. Now, another thing you wanna do is grab one of these. This is the IVC booklet, IVC booklet. These are in the front of the store by the ad. Um, and these last all month long. You can reuse this over and over again, and we're gonna be using this bit coupon. And hopefully the razors come out to be free. I mean, we get free razors all the time, but you know, I like to do these deals because I have to show new people who are couponing to make sure that they don't miss out, even though I have 5,000 packs of razors. So here is a deal on razors. They are buy one, get one 50% off. And when you spend $15, you are going to get 5,000 points. Now, we have $3 off coupons. I'm getting ready to show you those. They were they are in today's inserts. And then we um, also can stack it with this coupon right here. But it has to be four to 12 count. So make sure you get the ones that are four count because it won't work on those. It has to be big disposables four count and they also have some let's see aren't the, are these dispo these are disposables right 
yeah it says disposable right there i wanted to be sure i was like maybe i want to make sure that that's disposable all right so let me show you here's the three dollar off one coupon that i'm going to be using in today's smart source so i'm going to buy three i could probably get four but i only bought three inserts in the store with me and i have a ton of razors so because i'm not doing a fourth one i'm not worried about it um but if you guys wanted to you could so the first one's gonna come out to be 379 and the second one will be 79 cents because they're buy one get one 50 percent off so the second one would be 680 so half of that i don't know i can't do the math in my head y'all know i can't think on point like that let's just say 680 three It'll be three something. I just can't do the math that quick, sorry. It'll be three something and then you get $3 off. So the second one will just be some change. But then again, don't forget, we're also gonna be stacking it with this and the cashier only has to scan this one time and it is gonna apply for all three. So I'm gonna go ahead and pick up three of these. And when I spend 15, I'm gonna get 5,000 points. Now, if you wanted to do this deal, um and ask can you pay with points and get points back the answer is no on the sorry my hair is in the way on the deals where they say when you spend a certain amount you cannot pay with points and get points back on the deals where it says when you buy two like this is a deal where you can pay with points when you buy four you get 4,000 points. So you can, yes, C-A-N, pay with points and get points back on these deals, but not on when you spend. You cannot pay with points. So just in case, I like to make sure I clarify everything on shopping. And then also I'm gonna be using these to lower my out of pocket. Now, I have to do the math in a little bit to add up everything, but these are. this is gonna be a good trip, I'm thinking. So, so far I have three razors. I only meant to get three, I picked up four. So I have three razors and two toothpaste. Now let's see what else we're gonna get. So I just wanna let you know, the second one's gonna be $3.39, I did the math. So right now, just with these items right here, my out of pocket after coupons would be $8 and some change. So that, but I need to buy other items because I have a coupon for every item. You have to have filler items for these. Um, in case you still have these now if you don't have these don't worry about it you'll just be paying um cash out of pocket whatever you owe because you're not going to pay with points but since i have these i have to get filler items so i'm going to get something cheap like um you know a piece of candy and because when you're couponing at walgreens you have a coupon for every item so i have a coupon for every item so it's not like at CVS where you can just use these to cover your out of pocket with the, like the extra bucks is. At Walgreens, you have to have filler items. So you get cheap items that cost maybe 50 cents and that way they, you, you pair one of these with each item. So right now my out of pocket is $8 and some change. So I still have these to use. So I'm probably gonna get some paper products, but I'm just gonna double check and look around the store to see if there's anything else that I want to get. Um, they have a lot of clearance. What cost a dollar? I know it ain't that curve. Oh no, those are something else. I was like a dollar, but all this stuff's kind of thrown, but check your end caps because I wonder how much these Rice Krispies cost. But there's a lot of clearance and, oh, I need tea and tablets. I cannot find mine. I bought some and can't find them. I literally just bought them the other day. Oh, and then also let's go back to the razors. The men's are also included if you guys wanted to grab men's razors. I wonder if I should get a men's. Nah, I'll do the deal again. I'm quite sure I'm gonna do this deal again this week, so we'll see. Here's a good deal on some Lysol wipes and also the Walgreens brands. These are buy one, get one 50% off, but these are buy one, get one free. So these come out to be $3.79. So you pay like a dollar and something for these right here. Guys, I need these. I'm going I'm to I'm do that in a minute. Hold on. I'm, I'm going to do that and pay with points. I need those. 
All right, Purex Crystals 199. I want to say we had a coupon on those, and the fact that there is not any of these left, I think there might be. So those are 199. And let's head over to my favorite section at Walgreens. Ooh, they got Prego for a dollar fifty. That is a good deal. Remember, if you have a lot of points come to Walgreens and pay with points and buy your grocery items versus buying it at the grocery store. Dixie, buy one, get one 50% off. And I believe they still got this. Yeah, they still have this deal going on the Scots. Buy one, get one 50% off. So I think that's going to be the next thing that I'm going to get to use up these right here a couple of weeks ago or it might have been last week's inserts on scott's check coupon tom just to double check that's a coupon database that i use um so we have 50 cents off one so in the ad right here you'll see buy one get one 50 percent off on scott's so i'm going to pick up one of these would be five dollars and the second one would be i'm gonna grab paper towels 250 and so that's 750 and I have two coupons so I'll get cash I mean I'll get 50 cent I'll get a dollar off so I'll grab two of those and then now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to grab 59 cent candies I'm gonna grab four and those are gonna be my filler items now inside the ad right here this is what I'm gonna have the cashier scan um and that's 10 times the points when you spend 20 or more so i'm spending 20 and that is before coupons but don't pay with points because you won't get that back Ooh, these are a good price 1.99 for rice crispy treats how many are in there eight y'all i'm gonna have to do some grocery shopping over here their prices are good i know kroger's has a good deal too but when you're paying with points it's free versus paying with cash mm -hmm. so y'all know i'm a junkie for twix when i'm in the store also let me check the prices of the high chew because 19 cent this is what i'm about to buy a filler item they only got one of these um this is a good snack but definitely for a flight and i got a flight to catch so we're grabbing those for 19 cents y'all ain't nobody in the store so they ain't gonna get my basket some of y'all be like girl please stop leaving your basket but i'm always very cautious I, I usually always check we have 50 cent coupons on these so i was trying to see if there was a deal on those see ain't nobody in here and i don't have my purse today anyways i didn't bring it but yeah so oh i wish they had more of these that is a good filler for 19 cents. And this is a good snack for the blinds. All right, so I guess I'm gonna pick up some Twix. Hey, I don't like all of this nonsense. Where's the regular Twix? Okay, here we go right here. I'm gonna get two, no, one Twix, one Snickers, and I need one more thing. Maybe some Skittles. Let's go with, uh, this is hard the other side of the rainbow what's the difference i don't like all that spicy stuff bright side dark side i want to be bright i don't want to be dark i feel like dark makes me unhappy <laughs> it's summer so we're going with the bright side that's ridiculous that i would even say that but i'm like i don't want it to be dark i want to be bright i want to be happy it's like the dark side. All right, enough of that. All right, so I got everything. I'm actually getting ready to take a picture of this for Instagram so anybody else can see it. Hopefully, they can find those for 19 cents. And then, yeah, guys, so that is pretty much everything that I'm getting. Um, it's not too much going on at Walgreens. If I miss something, definitely drop it in the comments and I'll see it. And I'll hit Walgreens back up again later this week, probably tomorrow to do these deals again um definitely the toothpaste i will take advantage of getting free toothpaste all day long because sometimes 
um, I donate it. So with that being said, I'm gonna get ready and check out and then I will show you my sh show you my receipt when I um, finish. And I know somebody probably saw this, but I did grab the wrong ones, but I caught it before I checked out. So I have a three roll. They're working on the roof and I got the six ones. So just to make sure, make sure y'all get these cause the other ones are not half off. And I'm just watching my total drop. Yes, ma'am. Alrighty, those gonna be two with 41 cents. And. Just give it a moment. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All the coupons are running through now. So that's what I owe, and I am not paying with points. I'm paying cash out of pocket. Alright, guys, so don't do what I did. Alright, so we did get the $4 register reward back for the um, toothpaste, so that came out to be free. Now, Here's the epic fail. This is why, ugh, it's annoying. So I got 2,700 bonus points back. So that's for spending 20 and um, that was good. So I got a total of, that's almost $3. So let's just say $2 and cent the change in points and $4 back. Now, here's an issue. The big razors ring up for $5.99. On the sign, it says $6.79. That threw me under the $15, which did not allow me to get the 5,000 points back for the razors. So that's why I did not get the 5,000 points there. And it's too late to go back and do this. All my other coupon scan, but let me tell you what I forgot to do. That means I forgot to scan that with that long pause. This is a lesson in couponing. Don't forget to do this. This is what happens is when you coupon and you try to film, sometimes you forget, but no biggie. We're not gonna worry about it. Things happen. So either way, I still wouldn't have gotten the points back because it would have put me under the amount. So I'm gonna have to do this deal separately to show you guys exactly how it works. So I'm gonna do it right now and I'll show you. And I'm just gonna use this right here to pay. All right guys, so we know that these are ringing up for $5.99. So this will definitely throw your total off. So either way, even though I didn't use the IBC booklet coupons, it still would have thrown my total off. So what I'm going to do to make sure that I hit the $15, I'm gonna grab one of these in the women's and I'm gonna go over to the men's and get men's razors. So I know that I should definitely hit my $15 now. And I wanted to get these anyways. I guess it was a sign. What is this? Big Flex. There's a lot of Big Flex. It just says Big Flex. There's several Big Flex. So I'm gonna grab one of these and one of these and one of these. Oh wait, it has to be, dang it, it has to be four count or more to you to get the, to use the IBC booklet coupon. So I'll get three of these. Now let me do the math. Now that I think about it, this is gonna be a test because I'm still gonna fall under $15. Let's see. The IBC booklet coupons make this very tricky. If you're not a couponer, um, let me just explain to you. So your total has to be a certain amount before coupons and after IBC booklet coupons. So let's see if this still, if I get the points back. If I didn't, I'm gonna tell you why it didn't work. And this is a good lesson in couponing because I haven't used IBC booklet in so long. And plus, I don't know how much these things are gonna ring up because it was $5.99 for the other ones, which threw my total off. So I don't know if these other ones are on sale, but this is a good thing for me to do and for you guys to be able to watch. So at least you will know like, hey, this one's on sale or don't do this because it didn't work out for Tony. So this is gonna be a lesson learning video on this razor deal. And if it doesn't work out, screw the razor deal and don't do it. <laughs>
but I'm just testing it out because I'm curious. Hey okay, guys, so the IVC booklet coupon does not work for the razors. Um, she says that it doesn't match the item. It just specifies disposable razors, four to 12 count, but it's not working on the razors that I'm getting. So I don't know if it just has to be on the package that's in the picture or what, but either way, it still, it still comes out to be free after you get points so after all the coupon scan i did use a four dollar register reward to pay and i did get another filler item my subtotal was 255 paid 276 out of pocket and i did get 5,000 points back so i did end up using the four dollar register reward um because i just wanted to try this to not be confused if you just want to skip out on the razor deal don't do it or if you want to test it out it may work for different people in different places i don't know but they are all ringing up for 5.99 which is definitely going to throw your total off and again you have to spend 15 dollars before coupons and you have to hit 15 exactly or more it's not rounded off like 14.98 etc so it has to be over 15 so there's different ways to play with this deal if you want to try it out and test it and see what works and see what doesn't but I'm done with trying it because the first transaction threw me off the second one I did get the 5,000 points so I did end up with 36,000 points closing so it's still not bad I hope I didn't confuse anyone I try to explain it very detailed um, but if I did confuse you, I'm sorry. Let me know in the comments and then I will break it down step by step in another video. Just let me know, like, this was too confusing. This is like, but overall, toothpaste deal, you are going to get that for free. Use the coupons from the PNG that came out last week. Um, I showed you other things that were on sale in the store. So that's all I have for you for Walgreens. But let me know if you guys need me to break it down even more for you if you were confused. But Either way, the razors come out to be free. Um, part of me wants to know if I didn't use my $4 register reward, could I have used the IBC booklet coupon? Because you can't have overage at Walgreens. So there's a lot of different factors and I just don't know. Um, so we'll see. I'll try it again or you guys test it out. But for now, I'm done with this store and on to the next. Thank you all so much for watching. I love you to the moon and back and I'll see you in my next video.